And there is another provision under the relief package that could put even more money into your bank account. It is the largest ever refundable child tax credit. And as money editor John Delano explains, you may start to see some of the money as early as July. With tax credits, you normally wait until next year to claim them on your tax return. But this is different. Even before you file your taxes next year, you may start to get cash for a special child tax credit this year. It's a one-time deal and a bit complicated. Nice thing about this is it's now a fully refundable credit. Most credits will just reduce your tax liability so you don't have to pay as much to the government but you don't actually get money put back into your pocket. In this situation, you will get money put back. How much money? $3,600 for every child five or under, and 3,000 bucks for every child from six to 17. And one half of that money could be sent to you in advance in a monthly check. And starting in July, at least this is what the IRS is projecting right now, they will start making monthly payments to you if you're getting $3,600 for the child under the age of six, you'll get $300 per month. If it's a child who's say 12 years old, you'll get 250 per month. And then the rest of that will be claimed as a credit on your tax return in 2022. As long as you have filed a tax return, you don't have to do anything more. When you filed your taxes, you would have claimed these children as dependents. The IRS is also gonna check with the Social Security Administration to see the age of your dependents and who your dependents are. If you earn too little to file a tax return, take note. Well, you have to file a tax return for 2020 to get that monthly payment. Single parents earning under $75,000 and married parents under $150,000 get this child tax credit. But that's 90% of Pennsylvania families. In one fell swoop, it will cut the child poverty rate by about 40%. One wrinkle, if your 2020 income makes you eligible, but your 2021 income goes up and puts you over the limits, those monthly cash payments will have to be returned when you file next year's taxes. John Delano, KDK News.